Right, now, can we distill stuff in time? We might just be able to distill something in time. This is what this is what I want. If we can pull this off, that'd be great. We can. Only one, though. It's going to take us four and a half hours. This should be ready by nighttime. That's what I'm hoping for. We're going to put that water to use for a little bit of bartering. Bring us the moonshine. We're going to be trading with the moonshine. And bring some other valuables to trade with that dude. Because, I mean, he needs the medication. We're going to bring him that medication. He's going to give us a lot in exchange, which is what I'm happy for. I'm very sad that this heater is not doing what I thought it would. That would be a lot better than this, but we gotta make a freaking thermometer? I don't even know. I think we're gonna need parts for this. Ooh. Yeah, we need a lot of parts to upgrade the workshop. But if we do that, we can get the gardens. We just need one more electrical part. Seven more wood and a lot... Honestly, it's not too far-fetched. We might be able to come home with that. Eh, but wood does take... If we come up with a hatchet, plenty of wood from all of this stuff. And in reality, we just need parts. We'll try to barter for that, too. I think our action for the day is done. I don't know. Hopefully that'll just be done by nighttime. If it isn't, tough shit. If it is, yay. That's where I stand. But yeah, look at all that. One, two, three, four, five, six. Six things that we could chop down you think about heating okay it's heating up man katya you gotta chill uh what happens do we throw in more fuel does that make it warmer is that a thing i want to test out this hypothesis of mine does that make it warmer the uh, temperature's not going up i think it just lasts longer well tough shit we're gonna be freezing our butts off <laughs> sorry to say but hey Hopefully all this bed rest will get us recovered from those sicknesses. I really should not have built that bed up there. I feel like Pavel's freezing his ass off like, Guys, it's really cold. And it turns out the more fuel we do throw on, it actually does raise the temperature. I don't get how they're getting sick from fucking 15 degree weather though. That has to be like 50, 60 degrees. That's fine. And they seem to have like a decent chunk of clothing on. I'd be happy with that. Especially in this insulated basement. I feel like it should be a lot warmer down here. But whatever, let us... Oh, oh, shit, 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 Katya, you gotta run, you gotta pick up that alcohol. Pick up that moonshine. Also, we could get some vegetables from that guy in the trade. I don't know, but I'm, I'm hopeful. I'm very hopeful. Let us end this day. See what awaits us when we go back to trade. We're bringing Katya, that's for sure. Katya has to go. Everyone else, you get to sleep and shit. Pavel? Uh, we'll let Pavel be on guard. He is sick, but tough shit. And we're gonna be going to that garage. Garage. Maybe we could go to the military outpost to trade. And, uh, they're not really in need of anything, so. Ruined villa, what's that? Joseph, their hideout. They might be dangerous and suspicious. They probably have lots of supplies. We could try raiding the villa. Being sneaky deaky like. Anyways. Let's hop in this garage, see what it holds. Send Katya. Let's prepare ourselves, and we're only bringing what we need. What would that be? It's gonna be some medication. And some moonshine. Hey, <laughs> hey. This is what we're gonna be trading with here. We do have the gun parts. Oh, we could have crafted a pistol. I don't know, we'll see. Hopefully, we can get the hatchet out of this. That's what I'm hoping for. If we get the hatchet. It's going to be very good. Save us, like, five gun parts. And now let's go trade with this guy. We'll have to see what he says. Got some? Oh, look at what I have, my friend. You can give me a lot for this. What is a lot? How about a hatchet? This offer of yours is just too damn impressive. Oh, we can demand a lot from this guy. Uh, I'd like some vegetables. Give me... Aw. Oh. I don't know. Let's see what else we can haggle. This guy's very willing to give us stuff. I'd really like to make use of this. What is that? It would cost you. Vegetables would cost you. Water we can have for almost nothing. Give me like all of that. Give me both your veggies. It won't do. Try harder. Mofo, look at what I am giving you. Alright, I'm giving you quite a lot. You should be happy for this. Can I take away the water till this deal works, maybe? Nope. Alright. Well, I definitely want to get the water out of this deal. 
take that out. We'll haggle for some parts. They won't. Oh shit! Won't do. Try harder. We don't have anything else to give, really. So, unless we want less veggies. Like, eh, eh, ah, ah, eh. I really don't know about this one. I could really use some parts to try to upgrade our thing. Honestly, I'd rather just get the food so we can continue living. However, if I get some parts out of it as well, that's all fine and dandy. What can we get? Three parts out of it? It's all good, man. It's all good. We're gonna have plenty of wood back home. And yeah, that's 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 a deal, yo. It's a deal. Is your father gonna be better now? My father's unwell. Do you have medication or bandages? Bandages. We gotta bring him some band-aids next time. If we find band-aids, I know what to do. I already gave you medication, dude. You should be happy. Also, this hatchet is gonna serve as a great weapon to just like pow! Smack someone upside the head. It's gonna be great. Huh. Let's just go home now. We're done trading, really. Don't want to steal stuff from these people. They seem nice. We gave them supplies that they needed. So, yay. Day 23. Time to get to chopping, boys. We need that wood. This was one lucky night. It sure was. We got good stuff. Check this out. Did we get raided? No, we didn't. But ten water, two vegetables, a hatchet, and three parts. That's gonna, it's gonna keep us going for a good, good chunk of time. Bruno, where are you at, boy? It's all getting too hard. Chill, Pavel. Just chill for a little bit. Just chill. Might need a pep talk or something. Let's get you to chopping. Where's Bruno at? Bruno, Bruno. Where's Bruno? I can just click on his. I think that'll. Oh, he's sleeping. Slightly wounded, recovering. Alright, Bruno, let's get you down there. Okay, how, what? Do we need even more fuel on that fire? Damn. Just a scratch, damn right it is. Man up, Bruno. We got some food to cook, baby. What can we get? Look at that. Six freaking meals we could cook if we wanted to. It's gonna use up, like, all our fuel. Let's get four meals. That's gonna be plenty to feed the troops. And use up quite a bit of our fuel, but feed the troops as well. Uh, our fuel hasn't burned at all, so I'm wondering if we could just throw in more to warm the place up. It's getting fucking cold. Oh, shit. We're gonna need more fuel. We gotta upgrade that, too. We really need to be as efficient as possible. Katya's very tired. Let's get you some sleep. You, Pavo, get the wood. We really need that. That's gonna be so useful. Oh, <gasps> we get fuel, too? Oh baby, yes, <gasps> yes, look at that, look at that nine wood, what is this, what is this, seven fuel, <gasps> oh this is gonna be, it's gonna be a warm winter baby, it's gonna be warm, let's, get, let's have you eat up a little bit, Anton, let's throw up, let's throw up a little bit, not, don't actually throw up, let's throw some fuel into this fire, make it even warmer, let's throw in another one, Look at that. That is that is a true fire. That's going to keep us warm. Don't worry. Eh, you can eat later. Anton, let's get you some food. Bruno, we're going to get you... Get you to, wait, did that use our entire... Did we just use... Oh, wait, why can we not... Oh, that's metal. I'm stupid. Please help me. Shit. Okay, who do we want to send to help? That's the question. Uh, who's... Who's really... Pavel, do we want to send? We'll send Pavel. Although, Pavel needs to eat first. Let's get you some food. Anton, let's get you in there. Oh, our fuel's starting to die down. Whatever, we'll, we'll remedy that in a second. Alright, Pavo, you you go help this guy out. We need Bruno here to cook up the food. Katya needs to rest up. And Anton, just going to keep being Anton. Katya, let's get you some of them veggies. And don't worry, I'm coming to help you. This better be worth my while. Who are you, lady? Hello again. Hi. What do you want? Will you help me with what? Thanks for the help. Thanks for your help. All the wounded recovered and went back to the homes. One of them still needs band-aids, though, and I've run out. Could you spare any? I don't have any. I don't have any. Sorry. I probably would have given her some, but I legitimately have no band-aids right now, so it's not really going to 
do us any good. Also, we don't have as much furniture to chop down as I originally thought. Turns out you can't actually chop down all of it. However, Bruno, let's get you doing that. I need some rest. No, you need some food, Katya. Get some food in you. Go get some rest. You'll be fine. We're not sending you again. We're going to send probably Pavel. That would be my best guess as to who's being sent next. Pavel, let's get you sleeping a little bit there, fella. Let's throw some more fuel on that fire. And we have plenty of fuel. Oh, we have that to chop down. I love life. This is amazing. It's amazing. It's amazing. Our hatchet might break soon, though. Eh, it's got plenty of durability. It'll be fine. Nothing to worry about at all. Except plenty of wood. Plenty of fuel. Look at look at all that wood. All we gotta do right now is barter for parts, and we're in the clear. What do we need to upgrade this? Don't we need that thermometer? And to get that, we need to upgrade that. We have the wood for it, we just gotta get the parts now. To get those parts, how are we gonna get those parts? Uh, we could go scavenging to a new area. Or... We could... Oh god, no. oh, so much furniture. And we could go scavenging to a new area. Or, I don't really know what else there is. We could barter, but I don't really have anything I'd like to barter right now. Oh shit, we probably should have... Just a flesh wound, yeah. Don't worry, you'll be fine, Bruno. I believe in you. So much fuel. What is that? Three more fuel, four more wood. What else can we chop down? What else do we have? We got that. I'd rather keep the chair. It's a nice place to sit. And we got one more, like appliance or whatever. Not appliance, what am I thinking? One more dresser to chop down. At least we got cigarettes. That we do. Oh shit, no. I don't want to send you there. Get up. No, no, Bruno, Bruno. Climb back up that ladder. We could... Eh, we'll chop down the chair if worse comes to worse. We could even chop down a bed if it comes to that, but I think we'll be fine for the time being. Can we not chop down that dresser? Like, look at that. Just taunting us. Like, hey, <laughs> can't chop me down, bitch. I'm like, I should be able to, so this is shenanigans. What do we have in here? More fuel. Mm, how much fuel do we have right now? Look at that. 20. 20. Oh, that's so amazing. So amazing. Never going to die at this rate. Like, it's, it's getting decently warm, too. We probably want to throw in some more fuel. We'll do that tomorrow. And the day's about to be over anyway. Hopefully more people don't get sick, though. It's my work. Katya, how the fuck are you sleeping? She was, like, sleeping sideways. The hell? Any new places to visit? Quiet house. People are trying to lead normal lives. I'd rather not steal from them. I'd feel bad. City hospital has caution. That has danger. Ruinville has danger. Yeah, you know, let's head to the hospital. We'll do that. Who are we going to send? Anton. Alright, Anton, you just keep on sleeping, keep on healing. Katia. Uh, we'll send Pavel. You get to sleep, and then Bruno goes on guard. I think that's alright, right? Yeah, yeah. Get those two some sleep. Alright. To the hospital we go. Uh, we'll probably want to bring the crowbar in case there's fighting. That'll kind of defend us. And maybe we could... Or rubble. I think I think rubble is more likely in a hospital. Let's do that. Bring that. Let's see what we can't find in the city hospital. Oh, something right off the bat. They say it still operates? Yeah, I guess we'll have to check out. Parts? Fantastic. Exactly what we are in need of right now. Just parts. Hello, friend. How goes it? Yeah, okay. I won't do anything stupid. I promise. <gasps> Can she heal us? Whoa. But we have patients in more serious condition. Ah, oh, Damn. I don't know if I could donate. I could try trading with you. What do you have? Hey, he's got some stuff he could trade. Significant help. Symbolic contribution would be enough. Extraordinary donation. So it's pretty much trading with like a donation thing. Yeah. Wow. Good job being an asshole, dude. I don't blame them, yeah. 
Uh, I don't really think we can steal from here. Is she following me? Hello? Are you following me, lady? Or is she going up there? I can't quite tell. Also, that's weird. Like, when you go down here, the lighting changes. Do you see that? Quite odd. Hello, friend. I don't think doctor gets a salary. Who is this guy? It's actually... Oh, he lost his arm. Fuck, fuck. I can't steal from here. I mean, it's good to know, though. If we have anyone in terrible condition, we can't go to the hospital and... Uh, they'll heal us up. They seem to be a bunch of chill AF dudes. Huh? <gasps> Can we steal? Will they ever know? What is that? I, don't, I actually don't know what that is. Is that stealing? Private property. Oh, I don't want to steal from you guys. No, no, not gonna. Mm, it's got band-aids. Fuck. Nope, not gonna do that. Door's locked. Shit. Can we go savage anything from here? Hello, friend. Can I talk to you? Hi, don't make any trouble. Okay. I mean, if no one saw us, we could steal two fucking band-aids. Oh. Dude. That is so much. That really is. Okay. Just really quickly. I'm not gonna... I just gotta... Just... just no, he's, he's gonna see me if he stays up here. That's the problem with this. Are we allowed to scavenge through that? It just seems like rubble. As long as it doesn't turn around, we'll be fine. It doesn't say anything about private property, so I think we're good. How are they going to know we took it? They're not. Yeah, we didn't do anything. Is the bad private property too? <gasps> no, we can't take the food. That's his food. Hopefully he doesn't notice the stuff on us. No problem, man. I'm not stealing anything. I'm not stealing anything at all. All friendly here. What's in our bag right now? A little bit of food. It's not really stealing. It was in like a pile of trash. It's like they don't want it. Probably don't want this either. Nah, I'm gonna wake that guy up. This person's coming up. No point in doing that. Hey, I'm just being uh, friendly down here. <laughs> it's cold. I better close the window. You literally opened it for two minutes. Not even. You opened it for like a couple seconds. You're like, nah, too cold. Not dealing with it. Wasn't there a person down here? Thought there was. Hello, friend. Yeah, I won't cause trouble. Oh. Ooh. Ooh. 